Hey everybody, this is Anthony from Into the Darkroom and I'm excited to show you the new Lyra HTML5 blog template. Um, one of the great things about this template is that it does have a matching website template that is HTML5 and um, they have all the same uh, design look and feel and so you can have a great matching website and blog. So I'm going to show you in this video some of the features and go over some of the design stuff and just kind of walk you through this blog template. So. Uh, one of the first things I want to talk about is how it is design responsive. A lot of our photographers are looking for it to be really iPhone friendly. So what I did was um, I went ahead and I took this browser and I reduced it to kind of give you the feel of what maybe an iPhone um, structure would look like. And you can see that it restructures itself uh, to match that device. So it's extremely functional on the iPhone iPad devices. And so what I'm going to do here is just kind of show you how it rescales itself for any device that it's on. So it's going to work properly for all those devices. Um, some of the things that I want to point out as far as design goes is that this background is included. So it's a designer background that comes with the template. You can choose to turn it on, turn it off. You can also uh, upload your own background and you can get rid of the background and add colors and, and things like that. So um, I'll show you that in a second. You have the option to have this graphic wraparound. You can turn this on and turn this off. You can go ahead and upload your own logo here. And um, if you scroll down, you have an area for like a welcome text and then you have your post. Really simple, clean blog. Um, has the ability to, has a si to have a sidebar if you're interested. Uh, so you can add little widgets and stuff in, in the back end of WordPress. And then at the bottom you have, uh, of every post, you have all your like features. You have all your social networking. And if you click into any of the posts, um, you can see that it has Facebook commenting built in. So somebody can go ahead and start commenting um, and share with their circle on Facebook so you can go ahead and start commenting with Facebook comments and it's a great way to bring the social networking aspect into your blog so uh, go over some of the design features here I'm gonna go ahead and go into the back end and just kinda show you a couple things so if we go to the header you have the option to um, turn on or off that um, that graphic so I'm just gonna go ahead right here and I'm going to turn that graphic or off I'm gonna save it and I'm gonna go back to the home page and and refresh it and you're gonna see that uh, we've turned that graphic off right here so you can you can clean it up even more you'll still maintain this drop shadow that gives it a lot of depth uh, but you can decide to use that graphic or not use the graphic and changes the look uh, I'm also gonna go into the background here under our design tab and I am going to change a few things so I wanna show you that with the logo you can center it um, you can put it on the left you can put it on the right and then I'm going to come back here to the background and I'm going to go ahead and turn off the background and if I wanted to I could upload a background here but I'm just going to go ahead and change this color up a bit and you can either drop a hex code right here or you can just use our color picker and I'm going to save it and then when I go back to our blog here and I refresh you're going to see that that graphic is turned off and then we have this gradient so I have a blue that is running into um, a white at the bottom so that blue shows up and then it it uh, gradients into that white and so if you want to you can come back here and you can change the gradients so that they match go ahead and change that back to white and save it um, you also have a lot of options with the fonts so with the fonts you can use this uh, link right here to find a font and you can add fonts for the navigation for the header items and for uh, the, the description and stuff. So you have a lot of color options here. If you wanted to find a font, there's a link right here to a website that just has tons of fonts for you to choose from. There's some free fonts. I believe you can even buy some fonts, but numerous free fonts. All you have to do is just find a font that you like, click uh, Get Kit, you'll download the zip and you'll upload it in the back end here. And then um, you'll see it unpack. And mo most of the fonts work great. They're all created by third party designers. So um, not all of them are going to work perfectly, but uh, m many of them work really well. So um, a little bit of trial and error, but you can find fonts that work really well with uh, what you're trying to do. So, um, and then, like I said before, this blog has a matching website template. So you have a great opportunity to create a really clean looking blog and add it on to your. Uh, website template so you have the complete matching set and I hope that was informative and if you have any more questions don't ever hesitate to contact us through our support ticket system and I appreciate you watching.